Starting Friday, many East Texas businesses can reopen and welcome customers again for the first time. But several employees have told us they're concerned about going back to work and would rather stay on unemployment. CBS 19's David Lippman spoke with a local labor attorney about their options. It's natural for people to have concerns about safety in going into work now. And with just a couple days before retailers, movie theaters and restaurants reopen, time is running out for many people to decide if they're comfortable going back to work. But Bill Hummel says sitting out and cashing an unemployment check won't be good enough for the Texas Workforce Commission. A generalized concern about your health, I don't think is going to be sufficient uh, for you to have a legitimate reason to turn down a, a, a legitimate offer of employment. If you're concerned, Hummel said your first step should be to talk to your boss, find out what their plan is to keep you safe. If that's still not sufficient, keep the receipts, because then you can file a claim either with OSHA or with the National Labor Relations Board. Expressing concerns about workplace safety uh, which would benefit the group uh, is uh, protected concerted activity. If your hours have been reduced because of coronavirus, you can file for partial unemployment and the state will make up the difference. But Hummel said that probably won't apply to a restaurant's wait staff, where reduced occupancy will mean reduced tips. Most restaurants will pay uh, 2 13 an hour and rely upon tips to make up the difference to get the wait staff to at least minimum wage of 725 an hour and if they're not seeing the volume of tips you know that may very well be a minimum wage issue which again is something to bring up with management we've got you covered east texas david Lippman, cbs 19. governor abbott said of the 1.9 million texans who have filed for unemployment during the pandemic only 300,000 have not been approved yet